like most kids, I had no idea what I wanted to be when I grew up. And really the answer had been in front of me my whole life as my grandfather and my uncle are both pharmacists. And I think I deep down always knew I'd want to be in healthcare. I just wasn't sure what. One of the teachers that was at my high school, his family owns a, a few pharmacies in the area. And so he, uh, he got me in and I felt, I felt like I was doing something important. When I was 16 years old, I got the opportunity to work in a pharmacy and getting to know patients and forming relationships really just made me think, wow, I want to do this for the rest of my life. It's been quite a journey since graduation. I graduated from the University of Waterloo School of Pharmacy in 2023. So my experience here at the University of Waterloo Pharmacy School is that it's been a very experiential place of learning. I ultimately decided to come to Waterloo because of the CAP program. It's the only one in Canada and that really sold me on the school because I could start exploring my future career right out of high school and build those connections. CAP, Conditional Admissions to Pharmacy. It starts in high school where students can apply before university, they get conditionally accepted, and as long as they maintain their grades, then they're accepted into pharmacy in their third year. The CAP program was probably my biggest pull because it was like a really safe option. I applied and I got in and so um, that was another step in my journey. So then I went to the University of Waterloo for two years and then when it came time, we all applied to the School of Pharmacy and um, as you can see from me sitting here today, um, I got in. The best thing about the program for me personally is um, just a smaller cohort and being able to um, build friendships. You really do get to know everybody. You gain some of your best friends for life here. Two of my best friends from pharmacy school ended up standing in my wedding. The school here has built a reputation of, of being a, a really close-knit body with great leadership. Our school is a bit more tight-knit, I feel, than, than some of the other schools. You know, we only have 120 people. There's a saying that we always had, and I used to not like it in the beginning because I thought it was so cliche that, you know, here at pharmacy we're a family with a PH. Um, I thought that was really nice, just kind of that camaraderie. I feel very supported in this program. I feel like I can do a lot as well. And I, I think it's really been a place where I can cultivate my ambition. It's not all about, you know, the research and, and the research dollars here. It's about making sure they produce great pharmacists. Every teacher at the school is spectacular. I feel like everyone here wants you to succeed. There's a lot of support built into the program as well. Lots of check-ins, making sure that students are doing okay, both academically and in terms of mental health. And definitely the highlight, I think, of the PharmD program at Waterloo is the co-op experience. We're the only pharmacy school in Canada that has paid co-op opportunities. Meaning that pharmacy students get the opportunity to choose from lots of different kinds of jobs before they graduate and try different things on for size. Students can work anywhere in pharmacy. And when we say anywhere, if they have a co-op placement, they want to do it in a different province, we'll help them arrange that. If they have something in a different country, if they want to go on a relief mission in pharmacy, we could help them arrange that. I went to Moosonee and Moose Factory. They're about 800 kilometers north of here. Just the most unique experience that someone like me from the GTA area would have never thought was possible. You're gonna get three co-ops throughout your time at Waterloo. That's very unique. I work at Walmart and it's between um, head office and community pharmacy. And both roles I love so dearly. Blue Water Health in Sarnia. Shoppers Drug Mart in their head office setting. Independent pharmacy in Burlington. It also prepares them for the workforce. They're really comfortable looking for jobs, interviewing for jobs, and making a lot of connections and networking. And so I think the co-op program is probably our biggest asset. A lot of things have changed in pharmacy in the last few years, and it's going to continue to change rapidly. And I I think the forward-thinking leadership of the School of Pharmacy has looked out. What's it going to look like 10 years from now? What's it going to look like 15 years from now? A lot of interest is around AI. We're anticipating things like climate change. So we're training students a lot for these, these non-traditional ways of caring for patients, but also anticipating huge societal changes. I know that every single pharmacist that goes through this program is going to be so well equipped to take on these changes and tasks with the utmost care and respect and professionalism. I've heard this multiple times from multiple different employers in multiple different settings, whether that be community, in hospital, um, in industry. Waterloo students are by far the most complete pharmacists that they've seen. It does pay off the, the hard work you're doing, so if you keep working hard, you'll end up in a spot that you like being in. I am so glad I came on this journey because it's been so rewarding and and 
I wouldn't change a thing. So I really think if someone was thinking about it, like, come here. It's, it's amazing. The atmosphere is great. Thank you.